I need the jetpack to give me a bit more oomph for it to be fun for me. I usually like movement abilities. It just feels a bit limp to me, the jetpack. It just doesn't, doesn't kick me far enough. I need to go like twice as high and like 25% to 30% more forward. And I know it's better if you jump off the top of like a, uh, like a cliff or something, but even doing that, I still don't think it's really like that fun for me. I, I need more from my jetpack, you know? I just need more. Alright, I got stun grenades to no, maybe not take off of our friends. <laughs> like, it's not terrible. It's, it's, I th I'd say it's like a solid good. I've also got EMS mortar. Yeah, and you can't use a mortar again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it takes up a backpack slot, which is a problem. Requesting sentry. Calling down a oh, this is one of these ones, right. Ah. Got a sample. I should have brought the laser cannon. These missions pop off. First breach west. Rather than airstrikes. I thought this was an eradicate, not a scientist attraction. Oh, I forgot to start the timer. Oh, watch out, super citizens! Work. Get up! <laughs> Get up, super citizen! No! You killed her! You shot her in the knee! I'm sorry. They were class A, soldier! Stims. I wish I could have stimmed them. Probably the game would have allowed it. Send in the next wave. I'll protect you, ma'am. Did you think it was a Laz? I don't know. Did I just fire it? I'm gonna throw it down early supplies. Wait, where'd my eat go? Did I did I point blank my eat? Is that where my shield went? Yeah, I think I thought the eat was a Laz cannon. <laughs> Oh man, that's where my shield went, isn't it? <laughs> Didn't even notice. Was too busy commiserating over the, the dead super citizen. Thank you, shield. I do that sometimes, and I've been using that for support weapons a lot, and I switch to eats. I do do that a lot. It's That, that tracks. I have a eat dementia problem. What do you think the next fucking meta primary is gonna be because the sickle the sickle just made it like break or fucking who for me at least what do you think's next you think the next world one will have another like cracked primary calling down a support weapon oh my god yeah watch those super citizens jesus Cover the Sims! Requesting air support! Stack them up! Stack oh those bu bug bodies up! And clear them out with an airstrike like Tetris! Leave them ever I'm using. That'd be nice. Uh, an alternative to Redeemer would be nice. Requesting sentry. I hope, like, sometime soon in the next month or two, we see a big, another big balance patch from them. Sentry. I think we're due Stop. for more balancing. Calling down a sentry. Yeah, I, I agree with Kraken. I'd rather they balance the current side arms. There's no reason, just, in, in my opinion, double the damage on the revolver and the initial primary. Just make the initial pistol, like, a, say, say it's a 45, basically. Oh. 45 caliber pistol. Just double its damage to the Redeemer, but it's got half cap, that's fine. Your auto kill du double the revolver to yeah, like, it's a bomb to like 300 so damage instead of 150. Oh god. I tank that shot for their sake. And um... In other news, then they're fine. Christ, and <laughs> give, 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 the, give the dagger a bit more damage too, I think. Reinforcing! 
Uh, Three damage would be the same as a grenade. Yeah. Throwing grenade. Three hundred damage is less than what the redeemer does in a second. Come on out to the grenade palm. is safe. That thing magdoms in like a second to two seconds and does an insane amount of damage. Like it sounds like a lot, but it really isn't when you compare it to what we're already doing. In, in a in a revolver with six shots that you round reload, I think that'd be fine. I need help, southeast. Because it does 150 now, and I think it feels like if the revolver took half the shots the kill it currently does, it'd feel good to me. But as it is, it feels garbage. King armor whenever you see it. Yeah, Ma Mango, I think with the laser weapons, buff buff the dagger, buff the, the scythe. But just halve the reserve mags of these laser weapons, you actually have to play the, the ammo game. The Redeemer is almost too strong. The Redeemer is fine. I would just like give it like one less reserve magazine, probably. Maybe cut its clip down by like five or ten as well. Maybe give it more recoil. Just something to make it not as easy to use. Because yeah, it's so fucking good. The Redeemer is basically a primary with sidearm level of ammo. File Titan. Whereas all the other secondaries like actually have like sidearm levels of damage. It's weird. One in head, I think. Like, the Redeemer is just the basic pistol, but better. I don't get it. I don't get it at all. Oh, I didn't bait it right. Fuck. Maybe. I thought I caught it there, but I didn't catch the aggro. I'll find down. Good job. You still get with the sickle with MG now? Yeah, I don't know. Who knows, but it is. playing hardcore. I'll tell you what, I miss the sickle being a las gun from HD1, but I do appreciate that we have a, a LMG, even if it's not ballistic. So, like silver free. linings. It's fucking OP a bit, but it's good. I like it. It's fun. It's probably not even that the sickle's that OP, it's just that the other primaries kind of suck compared to it and the breaker. They still gonna buff the others, you know, and that's why I said, hopefully, new uh, primary, uh, new new balancing patch soon. I really like the sickle though; it's really fun. Coming down. Yeah, sickles of just not that much. I would agree with that, Blinky. Yeah, it's not that crazy. Oh god! Hold your airstrikes, the civilians. Why? Why? Get back, citizens! Get back! But what is wrong with you divers? What is wrong with all of you? Why do you do this? We're here to protect them! We are protecting them! Look at how good we're doing! Titan! Holy shit, that almost missed the president and me. Wow. Requesting it to True, that's a good point, Bounty, because in one you had you actually had to bring resupply. That's actually a really good point. So it freed up needing to bring a resupply pack. That's actually a really great point I haven't thought about. Alright, here comes Sivs. Hold your airstrikes! Oh my god. Get in there, protect them with your bodies! Engage the bugs in hand to hand! Remember the basics of CQC. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I say Sickle's super good against bots for sure. Supplies. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, E3, absolutely. Whatever gives them cheesy melee with this cocoa. Can I actually. Oh, cuckoo. 
Yeah. That should probably be pretty good against bo bugs, honestly. Sh a shield plus like a saber would be like actually pretty good if it did decent damage. Maybe even OP. One hand. Maybe too good. I will hope so. <laughs> it's server it. Cut three. <laughs> Give me a proto zone. Basically, damn, give me a space scar 17. Driver. Yeah, the um, second one might be coming in. They should just make the liberator penetrator that a scar, where it's just okay, higher oh, pen, totally slower fire rate. <laughs> Heavy, stealthy, close. Watch out for the vomit from this titan. Thank you, shield! Yeah, DMR deserves buff for sure. Ending in an eagle! Oh, good shot, November. <laughs> Kick off! What you didn't see is the first one that uh, caught his mid leg. Sending in an eagle. On your flank. Let's go, hell divers! Pelican 1 preparing to depart. Requesting air support. Shuttle launch in 20 seconds. Extraction complete. Pelican 1 beginning ascent. I just want you all to know that Pelican has HP. Nah. You get spore spears as a slugger? That's awesome, Vera. I didn't know that. I have seen the Pelican in a heavily damaged state where it was leaking fire from all the engines. Really? I've never seen that. I've seen the Pelican get teleported to another part of the map when Jamble dropped a drop pod on it. Outstanding patriotism. Like it says, Dominator is cool, but it still handles badly, so we'll never use it. Yeah, Dominator is actually pretty good. It Dominator is like the Scar, I guess. But, but it like isn't quite as good as a Scar. Dominator is more like what I would expect a Liberator Penetrator to be if it had full auto. If you had the Dominator, if the Dominator could full auto and had like five more ammo, that's what I think the Liberator Penetrator should actually be like. <laughs> Probably not. Maybe not quite as much damage, but the Dominator has an insane amount of damage. Actually, that's too much damage, but um. The way it feels, you know? Probably like half the damage, but like up the fire rate. One small step for democracy. One giant leap in the death count of our enemies. Cuckoo Man says, I've blasted the crap out of the Pelican in my walker. It was on fire, but couldn't get it to blow up. You wanted it to blow up, citizen? Yeah, it needs to be more projectile speed. I'd agree with that, Oofy. Engaging orbital thrusters. Let's get that data. Orbit synchronized. Oh, I love this game. It's so fun. Yeah, the DMRs have that problem like too right with the Space Penguin. Where like the DMRs, especially yeah. especially the the heavy sniper DMR, Is that and a terminate broadcast? feels like worst handling than like fucking heavy weapons. Uh, as a secondary, it's kind of crazy. Cuckoo Man says, I was testing the forging of Super Earth's mechanics to make sure they had imbued democracy in every armored panel. So. Okay, that's fair. Hold on. That's, that's uh, yeah, fair. Yeah, it's Terminate Broadcast. Round of applause for you. Well done. Okay. I can hit that at a distance with the rifle well and get a sight line. Terrific job. Um, localization confusion. Let's go Vitality. Blinky says, the primary weapon balancing in this game is genuinely shockingly bad. Yeah, I would agree with that. 
Maybe not shockingly, but yeah, shockingly. Like... You, you wouldn't think it would be this skewed, no. If they're meant to be side grades. Like, you wouldn't think that there would be such clear disparities in what's good or not. And like, DPS isn't everything, but it is also important. Especially because of ammo efficiency, and there's just some guns that are just clearly better, like Sickle versus Normal Liberator now. It's like, why would you take the Normal Liberator? The shotguns all kind of have their uses, I feel like. Maybe, I haven't tried- uh, this Breaker Incendiary doesn't seem very good. It depends, what would you call like the median gun? Because the Sickle and the Breaker are like top tier. Shriekers. Birds! Oh. Do we have it auto cannons to kill him? Auto cannon to kill him. Uh, I've got recoilless and I think we have an auto cannon. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wait, wait, Brit. Do Brit, auto cannon can kill those if you just lay into them. Okay. Defender? Yeah, the SMG, the Defender SMG. If that's like the middle of the road, the other guns uh, aren't I, that underpowered compared to uh, it, I we guess. Found the super sample rock you know what I mean? Like, is it is it because we're judging everything by like the best in the game? I don't know. But then is that what we should be judging it by? I guess we're gonna kill this thing. Uh, yeah, looks like it. Standing in an eagle. That shot ricocheted back near me, and I don't like it. <laughs> oh, did I backblast someone? Because, yeah, the, the defender is really good when you get it, compared to the lib. But then it gets outclassed by the breaker, and I think the sickle. I've tried using the defender again, too, and it's, there's nothing wrong with it. It's not bad, but it's not amazing. I'm on it. I'd say it's, like, good. So, Let's yeah. get some elevation so we can take the shriekers. That said, they're smart devs, though, so I do expect them to get to it eventually. I'm taking it out. Alright. I think I can also understand them being like pretty slow on balancing, considering the we absolutely got a second nest in the distance too. Let's deal with this one first. Absolutely insane. Can we back the about yeah, yeah, you yeah, you can auto cannon the bug nest. The cannon. You can auto cannon the uh, the yeah. The absolutely insane tantrum the community had about balancing the railgun has probably made them like go much slower on balancing now. I'm gonna be waiting here and just trying to hit these nests. Yeah, I don't know if you have to hit the stem or the no. There you go. Yeah, slap them up. I'll Which make sure you're very covered. tanky. Nice. Bitch is coming from the west. On one more. Requesting air support. I think that's short. Yeah, it's short. The mortars are actually keeping them in place. I think. The big pack is right there in the EMS. Sending in an eagle. Yeah, I was using it today, Blink. He's actually useful. Dead. Hello, fucko. I'm out! Requesting advanced weaponry! Emerald says, I wonder how opinions on weapons will change after the third alien show up. Yeah, it's a good point. Last one out there, I should be able to get it. Ah, oh, well done. And as they change balance, too, because they're changing the. Oh, I forgot to start the timer again. Whoops. Oh, well. I had like another five minutes of the timer. Because right now, you, you kind of value everything based on either raw DPS or how it can handle armored enemies, because bots and bugs, both armored enemies, there is a lot. But as they add less armored enemies and more just like bad enemies in general, like the birds, scary stuff, like that's what Illuminate is all about, you know? So Illuminate is going to be different. Oh god. Ah, oh, yes. it. I couldn't bait it there because the 110s forced me off. But that kind of like changes the game, right? Like, like if, if D9s were like less charges than Titans, but just all Hunters, weapon balance would be a bit different. Uh, I mean, weapon meta opinions would be a bit different, you know? What do we got here? A few. Looks like you can really see patrols on the map, mini map, actually. That's interesting. Regular aliens don't show up as much. Or they do. Maybe we just have the booster this time. Parking location. Uh, does anyone need this? Oh, Airstriking. 
Sending in an eagle. Take it. Democracy's on its way. And the, I, that's, that's what the game needs, you know, just more and more light armored enemies that are still very dangerous, like stalkers, hunters, the birds. Bot snipers, I don't know, like, Illumina in general. More variety in that way is it going to be good. Bunny says, aren't both the flyers and the stalkers are specials that only spawn on maps with their nests? Weapon meta might change as they introduce more of those kinds. Yeah. If, if those enemies could just show up naturally more, like if there was always birds, Southwest. like that would be very different. Actually, same as, same as if there was the always stalkers. Well, of course. Alright, Yeah, spear missions are completely different too, absolutely. Spear is changing up a lot. Because my auto cannon is getting low. Here! Oh, that works too. Thank you very much, but go ahead and take I, my I, supply button. I'd like to see that more, you know? I'd like to see more, like, not just nests, but, like, just the whole spewer variation thing. Like, it'd be cool if, like, okay, this mission is just, like, a bird mission. This mission is a stalker's mission, you know? And it's not about, like, getting their nests, it's just, that's the special enemy for this time, instead of, like, chargers and titans. That'd be cool. And then you could, like, go above D9 difficulty when they introduce more difficulties and just have those enemies naturally show up all the time on, like, D14 would just be, like, every bug enemy type shows up all the time, you know? That'd be cool. So you go, if a 500 kilogram bomb was coming down in our position right now, would you hug me and save me? Yes. If, would you still I love me you. if I was a 500 kilogram bomb? <laughs> I absolutely would. Oh, uh, awesome. I think we'd love you more. Bridge. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say it. Oh fuck! File fewer. Calling down a support weapon. AT drop behind us. Don't get squashed. Wait, never mind. I'm not screwed. Laser. Air striking. Requesting air support. Auto cannons going up. Say hello to democracy. We got this. I don't need to spin my strikes. Reloading. Sir, east here. Oh, just one of you fuckers. Fine, Kraken says, do you think it'd be more interesting CS if that sort of thing was rolled at mission start about you knowing, or if it was a mission condition you knew about beforehand? I mean, it's interesting in that, like, you get to bring very loadouts, <laughs> if you don't know. I don't know. It's just that easy. I don't know, you know. I think... Auto Cannon, name a better duo. I think it'd have to be, like, part of the design intentionally, is that, like, you don't know what's gonna come, so bring, like, balanced loadouts. I don't know. Sometimes being topical would be nice. Yeah, maybe, maybe like sometimes, sometimes yes, sometimes no. I don't know. Just like step all Tagging around. Okay, cancel that. Bug nest. East. Requesting air support. Air dragon. Sending in an eagle. Unleashing democracy. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, we could all just air strike, I guess. Reloading. Yeah, 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 that could be like annoying if it happens all the time, cracking exactly. Heavy, southwest, close. Requesting air support. Oh, okay. Fuck. Now we're good. Nice. Not dead yet. Thank you, Brett. I'm not Super Earth's greatest Helldiver, but I try. Doctor says maybe that could be intel you secure in the first second mission of an op to take advantage of in the second third. I would love that. I would love if the operations had some strategy to them. Like, it's like, if you... 
activate the ICBM in mission one, it has an effect of like, I don't know. But you gotta be careful, you don't wanna make it like less spawns in the second mission, because that just makes the mission boring. I don't know, like, maybe if you ICBM, there's like Two less ti Vile Titans in the next mission, but if they're replaced by lighter enemies. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, that looks horrible. Maybe if you get the intel first, you just get to know what's coming, stuff like that, yeah. It'd be cool though, like I agree it'd be cool. I, a cool idea that basically the order you do the missions in matters and has effects, that would be cool, like applies its own modifiers. That could be really cool. I, I want more games to do that in general, like you know um, the Battle Members game that's coming out, Menace? The new sci-fi Battle Members? I really hope they do that in it. For like, you're like you're doing missions and it's like causing like combined arms basically effects. Down a Damn it. Weapon. Bounced off. Requesting air support. That's a really cool idea. I hope they do that one day. Yes. That'd be a nice way to add more strategy to these, these ops. Woo! Especially if you imagine that they keep doing the thing where, like... The higher the difficulty, the more objectives for an operation. That would mean that if they do go above D9, they're probably going to add like... 10, 11, 12 would be 4 missions in an operation. 13, 14, 15 would be 5 objectives, 5 missions. For free. I'm kind of a believer in them. Right? And then also more objectives on Every the maps themselves, so bigger like maps too. targeting system malfunctions entirely, but... So that'd be cool. They're pretty cool though, and every now and then. You are like Left 4 Dead campaigns worth of content at that you point. The if you do a, a five mission operation on difficulty 14 with like four or five like mission objectives per mission, that'd be sick. I think we managed. But this is currently the optional to affect the current mission. Yeah, like that, but like lasting over the operation at a, at a meta level. But he says, yeah, like you start a mission of complex stratagems, but you find the mission that causes it so you can fix it, and the rest of the op loses that effect. That's a great idea, yeah. That's a great idea. That's a really good idea, actually. Stack a bunch of debuffs like that. And pick which one you want to remove. Like taking out bot AA. Charger close. Um, takes away the anti-air debuff. Kinda. Where you lose the stratagem slot. It's a really good idea. I like that a lot. Requesting advanced. Then you get to pick your poison. I like that a lot. Oh. Yeah, I like how infested planet get works. Away That's from right. The explosive barrel. I hope they do that. They're smart devs. I think they'll do cool shit because they're smart devs. Oh god, the the, the bug is throwing the bar barrel at us. You guys see the drone roll the explosive barrel at us? Chad, is this real? Oh god. I'm out! Three chargers on the field. Airstriking, pull back. Reloading. Pull back, I'll airstrike. Sending in an eagle! Throwing down a laser. Holy shit. Behind you, Orange. Got it. 500 kiloing, 500 kiloing. Watch the 500 kilo. Okay, Sounds good, like good, 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 if it never gets added, I'll make a feedback request about yeah, it one day. Really cool. Yeah. Oh yeah. Is our next Time to leave. Let's bounce. By the way, I'm still really excited about Menace coming out this year. I hope it doesn't get delayed. It's totally fair if they had to, of course, but I hope uh, they're on track because Menace looks like it's going to be so much fun. Beetle, help me fight for these samples. Okay. Excellent. Okay. Got those samples, Brit. Thanks, Beagle. Oh, I actually didn't get them. That was a lie. I was saying you got them. I did. <coughs> But then they're back there. Requesting advanced weaponry! 
That would be cool if they win, yeah. I agree with you. Supplies are if anyone needs them. Go and resupply long. Requesting advanced weaponry. They're throwing down another auto cannon. Because I, I just got the samples and ran. I love the scope on this thing, it's so good. Such a good gun. So, 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 so good. And my box is here. If you need them, recoilless users, come oh, grab them. Be useful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know world ammo is for the AT. Thank you, Rick. Ship bags ahead, north. We got nest west. Shooting of the scope is like if squad was fun. I think I appreciate you, the gospel Control of auto turret plus in. EMS mortis is blinky. Auto turret, like, that's a breach run. Uh, it isn't. Oh, you stopped it, nice job. Well done. That, that, that must have been right on the edge. Auto turret, you mean, um, auto cannon turret? about to break. <laughs> Sorry, my bad. <laughs> Pretty sure it's the same scope as the Liberator if you don't remember it. Oh, maybe I never maybe I never iron sighted the normal lib. I mean we're probably gonna wanna kill these before we extract. Enemy elite, east, fifty meters. Dropping a pin, northeast, one hundred meters. Do you guys wanna know some curse knowledge? Always. If you finish the primary objective, like all of the orange, um, spawns, like, patrols spawn like four times faster. Oh, yeah. So if you want to clear the map, do it before you finish the last objective. <laughs> Ideally. Requesting air support! Requesting air support. Oh, that's so cool. Requesting air support! Oh, I didn't kill that one, my bad. Yeah, if you guys haven't used that, I definitely recommend going into options, looking for the dynamic toggle switch option, whatever it's called, for um, iron sighting and third person aiming. The one where if you, if you single click, if you just do a single tap, it iron sights, but otherwise it zooms in third person. Copy, moving. It's really useful for being able to have both your cake and eat it too oh, with controls. Right there. Sentry's Dynamic game is cool. There you go. I'm gonna airstrike it. Oh god. <laughs> Always gonna throw your airstrikes not like so they airstrike it. Don't wanna catch my teammates a bit, you know? You can't throw it this way because that would get left and right, so I have to run to here and then throw it this way. I don't know who I'm talking to, like, everyone knows this, right? Nice. Down a support this isn't news to anyone. Everyone knows. Yeah, the Shaper Run's so cool, Lucky. I love it. You can turn it, um, you can turn it off right, Zuck, right? Can't you? Or can't you? Yeah. The other cool thing about bug breaches is be if they were, like, fucking... <laughs> they don't have Breach to be. be clear? If they were like Gears of War, where it made like an E hole, and you could like fall down it. That'd fuck up their AI though, so I understand why they didn't do it, but it'd be cool. Football? It's a yeah, football. Yeah, looks like it. Taking that. Go. 300 meters. Intense where we need to take it. No oh, feast. There's a, there's a charger right behind me. Hello. Creeper. Come on, buddy. Look at me. Look at me. Creatures would get closed in the snap. Oh, I didn't say you could bomb it like an e-hole. It'd just be cool that you could, like, fall down it. <laughs> it'd really just be a cosmetic. It'd just be, like, the bodies of the bugs would fall down it. But when you think about it gameplay-wise, they'd, like, 
they'd like get stuck around if it was a real hole, so it wouldn't be good. Oh, that one's with the patrol. Don't shoot it. Roger that. I was on monkey brain, lizard brain. I was about to just kill it because I saw it. <laughs> nice clean hell dive today. This squad's operating like a well-oiled machine. Brit, Shenan, Noodle Cup, and Ricochet. Well-oiled machine. Northwest. It'd be really funny as if the third faction was an Illuminate. Like, they, the, sh the shit that got down on mine was actually planted there as a red herring, and it's actually like ponies or something as the third faction. It's like horse people. Railgun seems that, to have a really low audio signature. The Equine Imperium. If you're not the one holding it, yeah. Get some! Get some! Breach on the right. Auto cannon going on the hill. Requesting air support! Charger. Yeah, it took a hit. Space Centaurs, yeah, the Imperium of Force. <laughs> you can definitely feel the impact of less Bile Titan spawns, I think. Uh, Legs open. There's been barely any this mission, I think. Which means I get to keep using my 500 healers for like anything else. Hello, there's one. Ooh, implanted that one. Nice hit. Thank you. Shirt. New mag! The nice force kill. heresy. <laughs> Absolute surgeon with that. <laughs> I've been using this for like 70% of my playtime, so. Be back shortly. Using what? Recording this rifle. Oh, nice. Are you able to consistently two-shot Bile Titans with that, or am I just... I can't do it consistently. You can... you can usually get it, but it's like... It's based on angling as well. Hmm. You want dead on, right? Yeah, you, you want always, like, dead on. Yeah. I heard a rumor that you and can... And if you can, shoot it in, like, the lower jaw, because it's got less, um... Uh, less angling there. Okay. I heard a rumor that the autocannon can kill Bile Titans if you have dead-on shots. I've heard it can penetrate, but I don't know if it's true. I think it can explode on them, but I don't think it can pen them. Interesting. Um, one thing it can do, though, is it can shoot through the open sections on the side armor. Once they're opened by something else? Yeah. Cool. That's light vehicle armor, and it'll also be pinned by laser cannon. Oh, goody. I'm on it. <laughs> the Aeon Illuminate Barley. <laughs> you're funny. Oh, you're funny. I think there's a patrol that way. You want some help? You want some ghillie relief, Brett? No. No, I'm good. Thank you. You sure? <laughs> no. <laughs> I got ya! No, I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. <laughs> You're not gonna miss that shot. I just know it. <laughs> what? Don't look at me do it. <laughs> Okay, what the fuck's going on back here? Oh, airstrike time. Airstrike. Oh, we're getting overrun. Yeah. Meanwhile, behind us. I'm out. Hell yeah. Is that a double hit? Yeah, I shot on E of it. Uh, shitter's nor uh, northeast. Be real careful with the, yeah, the angles on the airstrike. Real careful. Oh, yeah. Legs open. coming here around the north side. Oh, lordy. Damn, there's a lot of shit next to us. Airstriking to the I south. Care, care, care. Ending in an eagle. 
Care of the airstrike? Get some! Get some! Ah! Yeah. Oh. Freedom forever! Freedom forever! We tried. We did that. Okay. Nests are straight to extract your coal, squad leader, Shannon. Uh, probably want to just clear that larger nest around extract, and then go home. Okay, so we're not gonna go for the one to our east. Uh, at this point we're getting tons of spawns, so. Okay. Yeah, our. Reportedly, you can take more recurless ammo if you want, I'm fine. Uh, supply packet? I've got you! Thank you. Yeah, reportedly, according to... <laughs> according to information I read, we have four times the patrol spawns now. Off doing primary objectives. Yes. It's a really good Reddit post I read in chat that told me about it. Intelligence you have there? Well, it was from Helldivers who've tested it very extensively, very rigorously. I haven't seen Super Earth officially endorse it, but they haven't denied it, which usually means it's good. Oh, ice means internal cooling element by one of the voice actors. That's ah, I wonder why they say ice because it's a double. It's cool down. I mean, hell, who am I to that's deny? A, that's a good background. That's for Bile Titans. I'm not gonna sit there and say no. I don't believe you. The hell you say about Bile Titans? What do you say? I wasn't paying attention. It's both. So, well, Bionic. I'm not gonna say I don't believe you if you say there's gonna be four Bile Titans. I'm just. I don't, I don't believe many, it. I don't, know, I don't know how many bile tides there's gonna be, but yeah, apparently like hanging out, hanging out next to um, primary or secondary objectives that haven't been completed yet will attract more heat, and doing all the primary objectives in a mission, finishing them, more heat all the time, and hanging out near extract is more heat, and heat is just like more patrol spawns. What's the ordnance looking like? Think we can take that nest real fast? Oh, I'm down for whatever. Send yeah. Let's do it. Probably hit some nests from with the auto cannon if I find some elevation. Patrol, charger. Happy. On my position. Oh, that's breach, really breach, breach. Actually. That breach is uh, northeast east. Marking location. Yeah, it was two patrols, but I just stopped the nest. Okay, so remember it's. Like 50 meters is the air throw range without the suit that buffs your throw range. So, because I know the ping there is 50 meters to the breach, I can call it on top. Oh, oh no, what happened, Brit? I, I got pushed back by hunters. No. Oh. oh, we got some of charges here. I don't think we're doing this nest. We can kill him! Someone get my samples, I'll call the extract. I'll get him. Calling in extraction. Northeast. File active. Coming in. Requesting air support. Extraction shuttle inbound. Dropping a pin. Southeast. Right. 100 meters. Not Sending in an eagle. Oh, fuck you. Every, every time I throw it, they turn. Every fucking time. They, like, dodge it. They're so smart. Got that one, though. Oh, and it killed the other one! Twofer! Got him with the, the blade legs. I'm going for it! I got it! Nice. Tagging wow. South. 100 meters. ETA 
Where is it? Over here. Maybe. Maybe I can get it. Auto cannon going on the cliff. Oh, there's so maybe not. We got the mortar behind us. No, it's fine. It's just one tens. Oh man, this is a bad idea. I just realized. Requesting air support. Southwest. Oh. Tagging location. Fifty meters. Reinforcing. Ending in an eagle. ETA T minus thirty seconds. Oh. How do you get back to the? Oh. Calling I can in get it. I can get it. Surely I can get it. This is such a bad idea. No, don't do it. Oh, it's a bad idea. That's that's it. I I gotta get to the extract. That's all I can do. It's not gonna work. It's a 500. 500 is never getting nests. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta get out of here. Key back is now. I know! Let's go, Helldivers! Let's go, let's go! I'm out! Pelican 1, preparing to depart. Shuttle launch in 20 Holy seconds. Holding down a support weapon! Extraction complete. Yeah! Pelican 1, yeah. Maybe I should bring something other than 500 kilos. Maybe I should bring clusters. Victory was never in doubt. My team has the AT pretty handled. I didn't use them that much this, this mission. What if I bring airstrikes plus clusters when my team has the titans covered? I just go all in on like just obliterating breaches and shit. It's never Eagles one to fold except for rocket pods. <laughs> yeah. Bionic says, what if there was an AA bug that would shoot down the pelican if you didn't clear it from the extract zone? What if there was just a bug that killed you? I think there should be a support bug, actually. I think there should be a support bug like that, like this Eye of Sauron on bots spawns more breaches quicker. Or it, like, buffs all the bugs around it, like, just makes them faster, like, gives them ad adrenal from StarCraft. So, like, more, more health, faster, deadlier attack pattern animations. Smarter AI detects, detects you from further away, it's like a radar bug. The bugs are already pretty tough, they just need to be like buffed a bit more, I think, like, to, to be able to just run you down. But if they could run you down all the time, it'd be unfair so, to how the gameplay works. So we make it a bug that you can kill. It's like a like a medium armored big brain bug. And while it's up, all the bugs in the area go like twice as fast. Okay, calm down, safe. But you know, like, something like that. A spawn. Let's right, do which it. Which one is this? Is this the defense one or? This is the, uh, uh, city rescue, but not defense rescue. Yeah, it's a standing on. Synchronized. Hundreds of stalkers can run you down. Yeah, they can. They can. I say we start a evac. Oh, yeah. Let's start at evac. Okay. Okay, this time, if they don't, if they bring enough AC, I'm gonna go clusters. I used to bring napalms, but fuck it. Let's go clusters. Clusters and airstrikes. It's been ages since I used clusters. Let's give them another go. I like eats for random chargers, and I like shield pack. So this is probably the move. The schmove, if you will. Mm, we've still got like a decent amount of AC. I was the only person with 500 kilos, though, so I'm probably going to bring 500s again, because someone should have them. So say no to the cluster, unfortunately. Stick with the same. Someone should have 500 kilos. They're important to have. Lurkers. Yeah, I want lurkers from StarCraft Brood War in this game. Absolutely. That'd be great. More projectile bugs would be good. Yeah, like that bounty. Like the, the tentacle bug from HD1. Yeah. I just want more special types. I love the special types. I want more. I want like another 10 special types for each faction. And if you just really like make it varied, like what shows up on what mission, then you can keep the game feeling extra fresh. 
Because it's just one more element to keep the game feeling more different each mission. Bugs at the poison spores like smug, that's a cool idea. Mobile spewers. Probably want to clear this nest. Always. Look about it. Wanna hang out here too long? Yeah, whatever we do, we're generating heat by being near extract, so let's move. That's why I call it curse knowledge, because once you know about it, you're like, oh now now you're the guy being like, guys, the secret mechanics. Keep an eye out for a spore spewer. We're generating heat, guys, said a said a fucking lunatic. What are you talking about? What the fuck is heat? Fifty meters. Are you insane? Look out, Orange! Where's the flying boss? Yeah, bot, bot gunship! Let's get a fucking That's bot helicopter. Coming. I want to fight a fucking bot hind V and shoot it down in rockets. Cool, we're not going to have that pressure on evac anymore. Terrific. Well done. I want bot, bot SU-25s and bot MI-24s. And I want bot fast wheeled APCs that drive up to you and unload like a whole platoon of bots, like a quicker dropship that shoots you with an auto cannon afterwards. I want it all, and I want it now. Gentle says, "Give me raid missions of multiple format teams." I wish, yeah, I would. I would like that. For we were talking about it with Bed Bananas the other day, the idea of doing like certain mission types that bring multiple four man lobbies in together would be cool. I was also talking in Discord about like it'd be cool if you could have like ob us, objectives on the is. map that made you go underground, like a bot bunker Wild you had to go tank. underneath, or a a bug nest you had to go down into to kill. Um, because then it'd be like temporarily for a mission you couldn't use your stratagems that call in from the sky. You'd have to like do it do it solo tunnel Water fighting. Not the whole mission, but just like parts of the map. Like there's a nest tunnel there, and you just go in it, you know, and kill it. That'd be cool. I'm out. Yeah, like EDF. There you go. Not that booty, not that booty. <laughs> Sorry, Ricochet. It's fine. File Titan coming in left. How'd you like to taste the freedom? I'm out! There's a Titan, there's a Titan Southwest too, South actually, but it's not in here yet. It's slowly coming. Just wanna shoot his leg off there so it doesn't charge me too good. Hence reference marker, we gotta cut across uh water bridge. Calling down a support weapon! If you can just eat that thing, that'd be a uh, good ammo safe. That's what I can do, yeah. It, it doesn't even wanna like fight us properly. Do we need a resupply by the way? Here it comes, here it comes. I'm out! <laughs> Hunter body block! Let's go. Bro, fuck off. Eagle, where are you going? I'll catch up. Okay. Really? There you go. I am out of the toilet. I got it. 
Requesting advanced weaponry! Uh, patrol in front of us, y'all. Watch it. And... And bugs are coming over from the radar station. I'm throwing a resupply down on us. Sending in an eagle! I called resupply on us here. I had to grab two for recoilless. Twelve is like good, that usually means you got like a most of a patrol. It's one survivor. Bottom breach, right here close, right in our station. I drop an auto cannon. I'm out! Where'd they ever eat real soup? Uh, Titan incoming. Oh no, fuck off. Got it. Nice. Yeah, good call about hitting the mandible. Airstrike in the breach. Requesting air support. Get some! Get some! Oh, what do you mean, buddy? Calling down a support weapon. Enemy down, baby. I'm a shot pink! I'm a shot Brit! I was like, target, target, bug! I don't know why. Maybe pink's a bug color to me now. Freedom. Never tell Brett I almost killed her. I was like warming up. It's because the gun had warm up. I didn't shoot her. B for bug. Spanish says, so you went to grab another eat when you're already carrying one. Yeah, true. True. There's there, there's like diegetic UI to see that, but um, yeah, true. Anyone want extra clear. supplies here? I can leave a box for a recoilless or uh, anything. Uh, I'll. I'll grab I'm one. calling down a second recoil list soon, so. Okay. Well, someone else can have mine. Yeah. I'm pretty low maintenance. Thank you. So yeah, more cursed knowledge. The way the objectives work is if they have static aliens spawn on them as like sentries when you get there. If you kill all of them, the place no longer generates heat. It's considered like clear. If they don't have static guards on them when you get there, they always generate heat until you finish the objective. Uh, turn left. I'm on it! I'm gonna go check out the, uh, candy over here. I'm gonna cover you, Beagle. Enemy elite, northwest, 100 meters. Wow, look at all those objectives saddled nicely around this main objective. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be so much heat. Well, it doesn't stack, luckily. It, um... It's only whatever one you're closest to. Oh, okay. And it scales based on how close you are. So at 100, 150 meters is the max range. That's like 1% more spawn patrols. And if you're dead on, it's like 50% more patrol spawns, I think. Nothing to do with bug breaches. That's a tight. different thing. Don't look at me, Titan. I think he's looking at you. Oh, that is oh, a no. really cool piece of map there, yeah. That's a cool map. You guys want to kill it? We're moving on. I think you can get up. <laughs> you gotta cut west. Oh god, that's a hell bomb. <gasps> that's a hell bomb. <laughs> yeah, it is. I have an idea. Eh, it's a oh, bad no. one. Oi! Dickhead. There's terrain in the way from blowing it up from this side. I've got an idea. There goes my hero. Oh, it didn't do anything. Oh! It wasn't close enough, Sag. I don't think I hit it, though. Yeah, now it's just pissed off. Alright, I'm pathfinding us west, unless you want to get those nests in the northeast, or whatever they are. They look like things. Maybe they're spore towers or bug nests, uh, flyer nests, I mean. Because they got question marks on them, which makes you think they're actually like objectives. Mission at 30 minutes remaining. Dropping a pit. Although Lord, we can do them later when we do the main figures. objective, I guess. Yeah, probably.
They're mad. Well, straight if you run from the east. Oh fuck, I have a bad I have bad air I have bad airstrikes right now. I didn't realize. I need to uh, get rearmed. Not bad, but you know, I'm bingo on proper airstrike. Breach over there. Just chuck that. Get it, re get it rearming. Sentry coming. I can stop popping ices now. Good work, everyone. And you all looked really uh, heroic while we were doing it, too. It was a really cool line. Shinam was, like, up on the mountain. It was, like, a really good pose. Very artistic. <laughs> uh, is that Spore? Yeah, it's Spore down in the distance. It's, like, two, actually. Yeah, there's one to the right as well. 290 marks. 290 meters west. Good job, everyone. Objective located. West. Let's see if I can scrounge some extra ammo. I wanted to make this an armor before Helldivers came out, which is the funny thing. I, gotta... Reloading. I was talking to Cyclone like about a year ago, and I was like, you know what would actually be really fun for Armor 3 is like making a mission framework where like the spawns are like based off of bases that you destroy so you like blow up the the csat base to stop the csat spawning infantry you blow up the motor pool to stop the tank spawning on you and you go around and do like randomly placed objectives basically exactly how this game works but in armor so no wonder i like this design because i fucking like wanted to do it as a mod here. already it's a it's a great design it's really well done there's like mods like it kind of like it in armor but not really like they're not implemented the way i'd like them anti stasi yeah, kind of, not really. Not exactly, but yeah, pretty close, pretty close. I think this game nails it. Like, absolutely nails the format. Sorry. <laughs> It's gonna be hard to stop using the shield. This thing's such a big crutch. Versus bots too. I almost I almost like having it more for bugs than bots at this point. We got patrol behind us that's looking at us. Yeah, shitters to the south as well. Bugs, southeast. Requesting air support. Shitters to the west, we're surrounded. Heavy, southwest, 50 meters. Calling down a support weapon! Okay, I'm letting it load first. Then it'll be explosive, explosive, Heavy. static, static. I'm gonna go try to fire an Achilles crushers. Requesting air support! Nice. Breach is on the west where Roger, I did the crushers. Breach west, breach west. Oh, fuck. Danger plug. <laughs> <laughs> Titan over there. File Titan. Heavy. West. 50 meters. Stunning. Good stun. Bombs in. Good nice. combo. That's stun grenades. Yeah, stun grenades. Nice. Yeah, 
Hey, what's up, Bayless? How you doing? I love that we have two people with Eagle Strafing run. It's really cool. Never Titan, North It's my favorite underrated Eagle Strafing, or Eagle. Oh, I think it's really good. I like it. If there was five... Tank coming in on us. If there was Let's, five slots, uh, I'd probably take it more. Yeah, Roger. Nest here, close. Up east. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, it's going great, boys. Fearless is doing pretty good. Watch machine died. That's a pain. That's too bad. Sorry to hear it. <laughs> that is a pain. <laughs> gonna, gonna airstrike this nest to the east. Uh, it's 50 meters. Oh, 40 meters. You can measure it like by the map too. You see, that's 43 meters away from me or so. Explosive already. Requesting advanced weaponry! Titan's pretty close behind us, but I don't think it's aggro yet. Watch your left, Brit! Oh. Ooh, oh! Oh, 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 fucking problems. Thank you for hitting the brood, Lord. Circling back around. This, this sample acquired. Charger should be nearly dead. Got open sides. I'm just gonna stun it. New mag. Changing ice. Oops. Pack of shitheads coming from the east. How about a nice cup of liver and tea? Nice strike. Calling down objective equipment. Okay. Yeah, same same it's bones, yeah. For sure. That's the cool thing though about this game is that there's there's equipment that I think is cool and want to use, but I don't, but then other people bring it, so I get to enjoy it vicariously, right? Like I think the impacts are too useful for me to really bring stuns. Auto cannon should deal with them. But other people in my squad bring the stuns and then that's cool, you know? It's not like that stuns are that much worse to bring or anything, like, they're useful for a different reason. So as long as I bring impacts, and someone else brings stuns, I get to enjoy both being useful in my missions. I'll grab the, uh... It's just like as long as your base is recovered, you know? Oh, no. Reach, reach, reach. In an eagle. I'm gonna try not to kill that water cannon turret. No, I'm you see here. I'm gonna help them. Get some! Yeah, I'll be Get some! One in the head. I'm out! Ah! Requesting air support! Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. For prosperity! I think I must go vaporize there. Oh shit. Stunning. I'm out! Sending in an eagle! Delivery payload. Requesting Request. advanced weaponry! Deploying support weapon. <laughs> <laughs> it keeps happening. I'm out! Range me. Bugs. Yep. Good range. Artillery on the bugs over there. Watch out. Explosive artillery coming in. Five seconds. Start moving north. Mission at 20 minutes remaining. I don't know if I got anything. They moved off. Right. Let's move. Gonna do more arty behind us. 
That static field coming in, actually. That's not going to do anything. Ooh, but... Requesting air support. Maybe together. Going down a support okay, pressure. I got that crusher, I think. Yeah. Nice. Crushers can get one shot headshot by eats in the head, so you can kill three crushers per eat drop. Think Nothing about crushers it. dead. Nope, still alive. What do we got here? Bunch of crap there. Fuck you all. In an eagle. Oh, shit, thank you, shield. Oh no, green! Look out! 500 kilo dive! No! Oh. <laughs> I got rolled by the charger into it. I'm like, sorry. Man, the fucking charger bowled him into it. That's so fucked up. Board is clear. It's like our first death, I think. Nope. Oh. Nah, that's our second. Calling okay, in I fell through the world. Oh dear. That don't count, chat. Titans East. Request approved. Reinforcements on the way. I know what the arty is until I throw it. I think the Titans Can I get mad. a resupply after you? I've got you. Thank you. You want to just call yeah, on I a resupply? I jumped off that building and just never touched ground. Just kept falling. We can call on a resupply. It's off cooldown. Yeah, let's do it. By the way, no one mentioned that mile type that was like two feet away. Oh, can you guys not hear me? I said it. Yeah, Beagle said it. I guess it just doesn't notice us. Ooh. Um, Brood, come on, ship back to the east. Bugs, southeast. Can strafe him or we can avoid him. I think he says nobody cares what you say, Beagle. Well, for that's, now. that's just mean. Location. Uh, artillery that. There was more than I thought. Uh, we still got the Titans on the right. I mean, the Brood, Brood's on the right, Brood's on the right. Ow. Let's do it then. Let's do it. I'm going to airstrike the breach. Danger close. Stay on the mountain. Danger close! Hug the mountain, go left, go left, go left, go left. There you go, we're clear. Friendship bunker. I'll go for it if someone else does. I'm coming. Well, not right now. Oh, that's yeah. <laughs> Air striking the- oh, shit. I shrink the breach. Don't go in, don't go in, don't go in. No, no, what are you guys doing? No! No! Why? <laughs> <laughs> I've killed like everyone who's died in this mission. This is the dramatic pause of are we gonna be alright? <laughs> yeah, we're fine. It's just that other guy's been jumping for the fucking bushes. Nope, not this one. Let's um where we go. We're clear, let's rearm. Eagle one, leaving combat zone to resupply. is actually pretty quick. You just gotta be like onto it, you know. It, when you get those moments of quiet like More this, credits. just re just be brave and just resupply straight Pretty up. Sad. Don't be afraid to mull. No super Bitcoin. Enemy elite. And then we'll be back before the next big fight, hopefully. Ah, uh, we're gonna get detected if we go this way. Just dive back enemy this way, Grio. Oh, okay, that works. Okay, we're fighting then. They already knew I was there. Hmm. Heavy. It's kind of like reverse tank tactics. It's like you're trying to maneuver to get a front like. on shot. Which is like the opposite of like main battle yeah. tank flanking. Sorry, there was a little guy that saw me. That's right, Donnie, yeah. Before I saw the patrol. Exactly. Somebody reset Beagle's timer, team killing us. <laughs> That's like a nasty euphemism. Reset Beagle's timer. 
That's why I didn't tell Sammy's friend I was on a streak. Because I knew one of them might just kill me anyway just to reset my streak. Oh! For funniness. Yeah, that's funny, Blinky. I love when the bugs do that shit. It's funny. I gotta grab a box this time. Anyone need the other one? Okay, boom. Okay, cut. That is one thing, is that even though, yes, you can resupply all the time to get more ammo, note that if you bring a laser weapon in this game, like, the sickle's fucking good as hell, so why wouldn't you bring it? But yeah, even if it isn't good as hell in the future, by me not needing to take oh, boxes as much, because I I live, so I don't I don't need use stims very often, because I have the shield, and I don't rearm very often, because I, I don't really pop ammo much. I allow other people in my team to take my box when, it, when we resupply, so a recoilless user can really use that extra box. You know what I mean? Oh, boom! Oh. We're good, we're good. Requesting advanced weaponry. So it's not even about whether or not you'd run out of ammo, it's more about like... Southeast. You're giving someone else your box. Let's yeah, kill this patrol to our southeast, yep. No, I wonder, Fig. Probably Pull not. That way. Oh, Brent. How you doing? You stepped on the trippy drug mine crystal. I sure did. It's like anti-healing crystals. It's hurting crystals. Yeah, it does, Wyverns. Because they get the charges get some sick momentum going, so it always ends up being like a reverse Akira slide. Where, like, it slides into you as it dies. Thank you for the call. Breach, uh, Southeast. That's pretty good for a call. Take her rear. Rear looks good. Okay. Rail gun. <laughs> nice shit. There's a bug on the left getting EMS mortar, like, busied. Kill the bug on the left so it's not wasting the EMS, yeah. Number one. Ending in an eagle. Titan. Stunning. I'm out. Hit once in the head of an E. Calling down a support weapon. Deploying support weapon. Requesting air support. Yeah, that'd be probably good, Wyverns. That'd be fair. Because then you actually have to deal with the fact that you can't go over your limit as much. Incoming charger. Which would be an actual problem. Fire away patrol. East. Uh, east coming in slowly. Oh, Miss Trape's so. back up if we want to take it. Yeah, so I'm just going to rearm. Let's do it. I think we're still on reinforcement cooldown. Sending in an eagle. Cool thing is, being able to kill high drives on the front seems a bit much, but that's not sickle. That's just any gun can do that. You just have to shoot the right places. Whenever you see me killing a high drive from the front, I'm either shooting like their limbs that are poking out from behind their armor. I'm getting prone and shooting underneath their underbelly, like like a lobster that's trying to kill me. You just need to, that's all you need to do, is you just need to shoot around the heavy armored parts of Hive Guards. There's quite a few gaps to hit. You can exploit those. Yeah, it's super, super busted ammo on me right now, Wyverns, yeah. I expect some nerfs for it in the next balance patch. Now remember, don't kill the super citizens. Sir, yes sir. Dr. Sokrae says, Super Earth's weapon manufacturers cooks too well the sickle. Yeah, it's like the old railgun. It's a good thing I brought this regular mortar. The, the bot saboteurs <laughs> need to do some... ...sabotage... ...to our best weapons. Planting an auto cannon on this fence. Interesting if they did like a mutator or like um... ...like a, ban a banning drop oh, for like the hardest difficulty, like on the hardest difficulty, like the... 
like Infested Planet, they just went like, we hard counter this thing of yours. Like on D14, it's like, okay, this mission, you, you, you're told about it on deployment, it's like, this mission, um, the, the modifier is all the bugs are like, half as much damage from laser weapons, you know? Calling down a support weapon! Eastern Patrol. Oh god, citizens, look out! Citizens, look out! Oh, they're fine. All bugs are on fire. <laughs> I hope they bring in like super hard to really for this game. It's like really crazy like that. Just like weird, wacky video gamey shit. Like yeah, like all the bugs are just on fire. If the bugs touch you, you're on fire. Just shit like that. All the bugs explode in static shock, like Diablo modifiers, you know. Oh yeah, the sickle's really accurate too, Coil. Yeah. All bugs fly. Oh my god! Can you imagine? <laughs> Flying Vile Titans! I like 12 flying hunters in a patrol, that'd be incredible. I like a mutator of like realistic spawning ranges of like the bug patrols see you from like Don't line say of sight. That. I just see a Vile Tank come up. Line of sight basically, it'd be cool. <laughs> oh, he hurt. I had to go deal with that more fucking Titan. Oh, we got shits coming in from the southeast. I'm gonna ambush him. Huh! Ambush! No! All bots are on stilts. <laughs> New hives on the fly. See, yeah, just turn this game into Infested Planet, please. You guys know how much I love Infested Planet? If you think about it, Infested Planet is like top-down Helldivers. So can we make like Infested Planet 2 that's like literally top-down Helldivers? Like tie-in? Or can we make Helldivers 2 more like Infested Planet? On harder difficulties? Because that'd be sick. Like, you guys have watched me play Invested Planet. Can you imagine if you had, like, hardest difficulty this game, like, D14, when they bring it in or whatever, right? Or special mode. It works like Invested Planet, where literally, the, every time you do an objective or clear one of their bug nests, it, like, fucking randomizes their modifiers, and they, like, do shit to counter what's most prominent in your loadout, like, what's been, what's been killing them the most. So, like, if you've, if you've just been spamming Eagle Airstrike and it has, like, the most stratagem effectiveness against them statistically at that point of the mission, they bring in, like, fucking the anti-air bugs. Isn't Helldivers 1 top-down Helldivers 2? Sorry, strategy. Top-down strategy Helldivers 1 is Infested Planet. True. Helldivers 2 is Infested Planet. But now what? Traction? We'll probably go home. Yeah, Shadow says, but you can't then adapt them unless I mean, they improve the stratagems. True, time. no, you're right. But It'd have to be in between we'll missions. Home. You're right. It'd be at the end of a mission, you're right. Going home. 50 Let's go home. Hmm, you don't want to get that nest to the east? Down east. 50 meters. Oh, fine. We'll get the nest to the Down east. The it's the lost nest! We won't all die on the lost nest. It's been such a smooth mission so far. We'll do it for Super Earth. It's not yeah. the last nest. Where's the last nest? South southwest. I think that's fake. Uh, no, that's the cleared spore tower. Yeah, that's the spore towers just do that sometimes. Chased. Okay. You got the strike? For me. I've got strafe. Okay, I'll airstrike it. Hey. Just cover me. Sending in this an might get all three, we'll see. Might be a bit short for the back ones. All right, keep me covered while you're up for the back one. Yep. Here we go. Two charges in there. Hitting the back one, we can leave, I think. That should get it. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I got it. I do, yeah. Boom, target down. That's shiny. Anyone else love the noises the drones make? It's like sectoids. I got a rocket, yeah. Bugs on that, I can airstrike them. I love the noises the bug drones make. It's like fucking sectoids. 
let's go for a rearm. Eagle one rearming. Be back shortly. Tagging map. South. Far. Super credits. Excellent. What if a sectoid rode a drone like a goblin rider? Yeah, but when a bug reach happens, it plays the piano sting. <laughs> Can we total convert XCOM 2 into Helldivers? Can we, like, get the cosmetics enemy made, and then South get the enemies made, and play, like, a turn-based tactics version? They absolutely saw me. Oh, yeah, wow. Yes, yes. How would that even work? Sending in an eagle. Every time- Whoa, cool! Every time one of your- your operatives dies, you can just jetpack in a new one. We talked about this last time, actually. We can, with the jetpack mod, just jetpack in a new, uh, operative from the barracks. Diver, that'd be fun. Calling extraction. Calling in extraction. Ooh, that was close. Alright, look at me for once. Close. Wait, I'm not up. Fuck. Stunning. I don't think I gave a fuck. I think it was a bit far. Oh god, it's lost. I think I might have missed. It's a lot of trash. It looked like you're out of range, actually. It air bursts him, I think. Alright, one Titan down. Requesting advanced weapon reach! ETA team out is 1 minute 30 seconds. Oh. <laughs> Calling in reinforcements! 500's back at least. Heavy. Ah! Heavy, all my position. Is that a bounce? No, I'm good, but I'm also in an injury position. I need to help Orange. I need to help Orange! Hey, Lots shoot me! Friends. Yeah, I'm trying. Too many friends. Oh. Okay, it's on me now, that's good. I threw out a shoot at you, I don't know where it's going. Ending in an eagle! Okay. This looks good. Not good enough, but... Oh, fuck! Requesting air support! Come get me, you fucker. Kill the Titan. You should be clear, Two Orange. The AC's coming up. I gotta live forever. This Helldiver's going back to Super Earth to retire. One hour and 22 minutes. This one's going home. Airstrike in the terminal. Don't go to the extraction terminal. This one's going home to a warehouse job on Super Earth. Oh shit! Let's go! Breach right on us, move! Run, I airstrike, keep running! Let's go! I'm gonna live forever, I'm, I'm safe! In. Extraction complete. Uh, yeah! Last one in. <laughs> good job, everyone. Good good dives. Nice. You got another nice job. And a long climb to liberty. Good day of diving. I was like trying harder to keep them alive when I was playing with Sammy's group. <laughs> but I realize now. Oh, look at that. Oh, Beautiful. I realize now, in hindsight, hang on, I'll talk about it after I drop out from these guys in a second and I wrap up the stream. <laughs> I realize why I felt like I was being a, a baby with Sammy's group. Because at first I was like, oh, is the death timer making me like play different? Am I like being a coward? No, no, I realize in hindsight what it fucking was. Is um they're not talking, I was gonna say it. 
is because I, I think I was I wasn't cowardly on this at all. I think I was pretty gung ho, pretty much in there the whole time with this group. The difference is Sammy's group had so much fucking friendly fire shit with the cluster bombs and the 380s that I felt like I was constantly having to like fight for my life to stay alive because of dodging fucking airstrikes and artillery. I think. <laughs> I realize now, because I played with these guys and I didn't even think about staying alive, I just did. I've rarely seen Liberty dispense so rapidly. <laughs> and I realize the difference Welcome now. <laughs> GG, that was awesome. Really good squad, good dives, everyone. See us later. Yeah, there, there, are, there are women. Don't uh, leave Nate. without giving me a hug. Oh, come over here, buddy. <laughs> Psych, get one of these. Wait, how do get I do it? These. You do a donation from the Ministry of go. Defense. Have one of those for the road. <laughs> See you, buddy. And now another helpful tip from General Brush. <laughs> Add the simple joy of loading round after round into the palm of your teammate. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's good. But if you get bricked up, your stealth days are over. That's so true, Ministry of Defense. That's so true, General Brash. So true. Well, well, well. <laughs> oh, God, it's still from going. The of Defense. It's still going. Elite soldiers provide a relief to their squad so they can keep the sneaking going all day long. <laughs> oh yeah. That's good. <laughs> Brash tactics. Use more the yard. Yeah, use more the Thank you very much, General Brash. That's why they give you this test dummy here for you to practice that technique. Aren't you just gonna walk up? Oh, see, so my accuracy is a little off there. You wanna? Wait, wait, wait. Better. Good grip. But I don't know if that would cut it in the feel on a hell dive, you know. Oh, no! Now we're talking! There you go. And that's how you keep your teammate going. So there is a fire engine in Super Destroyer. That's right. It's right here. <laughs> Alright. This is a good day of diving. Greetings, hell diver. The galactic war awaits. A hell diver. This hell diver gets to go back to garrison duty, one of our safer planets. That's why you wear the yogurt helmet, huh, Biggs? Mongo, if you want to abuse me with your thoughts, you better wait until tomorrow, where you pay me to do it. XCOM Kitchen is back tomorrow, everyone. XCOM Kitchen. I'm sorry I didn't have as much of it for you last weekend. Stuff come up, like I said, health stuff with Jim, mental health stuff. Um, but you know we're. We're on the ups, hopefully, at the moment, so hopefully things are better. And I should be around for the uh, XCOM Kitchen Ardo tomorrow and the day after. Um, we should be going into April, I, unless I fuck up the next mission coming. I think we should be getting into April, because it's it's Van Dorn is the next mission tomorrow. You're doing it's democracy. Van Dorn Extraction. And then we should be getting them cleared and then going into April, I think. Hopefully. Happy people are doing better. Well, it's early days, but, you know, we're working on it. We're, we're seeing people we're working on it, so... You know, check back in a month or two. It's it's been a long-standing thing for for years and years for poor Jam at this point. She's really been suffering, but um, we're working on it. So, hopefully. Anyway, I had a great time with Helldivers as always. This game is fucking awesome. I'm gonna play it till I die. I love it. Uh, go home. Wonderful, wonderful master sergeant here. I should write these down. Whenever I end the stream of one alive, I should write it down for posterity. One twenty four zero four. I'm gonna take note of this one. I'm gonna write it down right now before I forget. Okay, one, twenty-four, oh four, and the hashtag is Helldivers Timer. I don't fucking know, but anyway, one twenty-four, oh four, survived in big caps. There you go. Entire two missions. Oh yeah, that's good. Did I survive? Did I die with this squad? The last time I died, wasn't the last time I died the cluster bomb? No, I, I think I lived with them the entire operation. The last time I died was when I got cluster bombed by Sammy's friend, I think, by Glucose Poppy. Since then, I've been good. That's not bad, man. We can get through operations without dying consistently. We're we're helpful to our team in not taking reinforcement tickets. As long as you don't lose aggression, you cannot lose aggression and become a liability to your squad. You have to keep aggressive. You have to keep getting the job done. You're gonna be gung ho. Rick says all oh, my deaths are either physics deaths or accidental. The bug never got me. Yeah, I know. I know. When when, when you got bowled into my 500 kilo, that was the first death we had, I think, in that mission at least. Didn't you have it like five times? Look, the first time wasn't my fault. 
the second time, I mean, I called that airstrike. I airstriked the breach. I called it. I screamed, no, please, get, don't go in. <laughs> and they were like, maybe we'll be okay down in the bunker cave. <laughs> the friendship bunker. <laughs> I don't think they were in it yet. I reckon it might have saved them, but they weren't in it yet. Or the bomb landed right outside their door. Anyway. That's it for now, yo. GG. I love this game. It's too good. Astanu's on 72%. 73%. Um, wait, are we going to beat the, the defense by the way? Let's check the globe before we go to. Ricochet says the door wasn't fully open. That must have been tragic. Yeah! Helldivers across We're the pulling galaxy ahead. are fighting for every inch of territory. Where will you join them? Crimson looks good. Shadow looks good still. But, divers. Astana, we're pulling ahead in the defense game there. But numbers are going down. The Americans are logging off. It's time to do your part. Did you just wake up? Are you from Europe, Asia, or anywhere in the world that isn't North America? It's time to log on. It's time to do your part. Wait, South America too, because it's the equator line, it's the time zone line, it works down ways. The equator is long ways. So unless you're in the Americas, it's time to do your part, okay? The Americans are going to sleep, north and south. It's time to get online and push Astanu to the finish. We must defend Astanu. By the time the Americans wake up again, the defense campaign will be over. We cannot fall behind now that the Americans are going to bed, because they're the bulk of the player base. You've got to get online, and you've got to defend Astanu. Every operation completed helps, so get in there. As for me, I'll be doing XCOM Kitchen tomorrow. How's um, this going, by the way? We have drought near. Creek is just forever a waste of people's lives. I love that. The bots have been real quiet ever since the invasion to get mechs. Ever since we defended Tian Quan, the bots have been real quiet. I wonder what's coming next. Anyway, I could sit here looking at that. Looking at that for hours, so. I'm out. See you next time. Uh, credits. And let's raid someone. Thank you to Mogdash for the 97 month sub. Croker for 56 month sub. Easy Pickens, 46 month sub. Uh, Stubright Forever, thanks for the raid of 21. Cliche for 20. Very generous tier 2 sub for 84 months in a row. Derhu pog slide, derhu pog slide, derhu pog slide. Thank you, cliche. For the very generous tier 2 sub for 84 months. Future Cyborg 64, 59 months sub. Physicist 79 months. Shenanigeist 34 months. And Mogash gifted the sub to Bush Tactics Gaming. Yep. Sure is. Alright. Remember, folks, serve in the Helldiver Wars. Um, retweet Helldiver's posts. And I'm going to raise you on to... Now, maybe he's playing Command and Conquer? Which one? Which one? Mm. Command and Conquer Generals! <gasps> yes! Have we read in our playing Generals before? Or is this the first time? Hell yeah! Now, maybe he's playing fucking Generals! That's awesome! Well, go and, go and say hi to Nemi Nemi. She's really cool. She's a really cool VTuber. Um, we've been raiding since we found her, discovered her playing Dark Touch. She plays Helldivers as well. Um, she's probably gonna play Broken Arrow when it comes out. I want to get her into it because she's a strategy game fan. And she's playing fucking Command & Conquer Generals right now, which is awesome. Hopefully at zero hour. It looks like she's actually playing the campaign. Uh, I feel like that building is never in multiplayer, that Empire State building. So go check her out. Generals is a really cool game. Hey, if you're too, if you're too young to know what Command & Conquer Generals is, um... It's a fucking great old RTS game, so go and watch it. And if you are old enough to remember, then uh, you don't need me to tell you. Though people do say that Command & Conquer Generals is like, if you're not being generous to it, people look back at it and go like, wow, how did this get made? Like, this is the most problematic game ever. But everyone loves Generals, okay? Everyone loves Generals. Look, you can't, you can't get Generals. You cannot get Command & Conquer Generals. I'm sorry, you can't do it. It's a fantastic game. And no matter what you see in Command & Conquer Generals, if you've never seen the game before, remember, everybody loves it, everybody's fine of it, everybody thinks it's great. It's a time capsule, says Dr. Danger. It's, it's totally great. Go and check it out, it's wonderful. I'll see you all tomorrow for XCOM Kitchen. Please be there. Bye, everyone. Have a good one. See you later. That's right, you, you, you can't milkshake generals. That's right. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs>